right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Concord Esports. We have Milky Gear Strata. Close it in my mouth like this. All right. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Encore Esports. We are live with Guilty Gear Strive. Axel Low. On the left we have Vice playing Axel Low. On the right we have some random from NY playing Zatzel 1. Hey, how you doing? Sure, man. I need some, I mean, I'm going to need the help. This is my first time commentating, so... In the replays. Still. If you have any game knowledge to share, anyone watching it appreciates it. You play Soul, right? Uh, no. I play Temkin, Chips, a little bit of Gold Lewis, not the drop. No, same! Not, not with the Gold Lewis, but yeah, the Chip of Temkin. I'm, oh, I'm leaning more good. Chip these days, though. But let's see what we got. Heaven or Hell. Letting intros rock? What'd you think? Yeah, I think so. I don't really know how this goes. I play neither of these characters, and both of them, I feel... I think if Zato gets in, he wins. Yeah. Let's rock. Yeah. Oh, no. Okay. Hunter Pulse? Yeah, he's going. I think so. I think both these players are really good, though. I mean, you can see that they're, like, how they use That, like, they're both really good at this little mission, though. Okay. <laughs> Zato's already taken a lot of damage. I didn't know Axel had damage like that. Yeah, supposedly there was some Axel winning a lot of you. I think so. I don't think you... I don't think anyone who's like... Who knows a couple of things with Axel Oh. Got that fly on. Oh. Not going for the other one. I don't know why. Oh. 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 Yeah. Oh. He just holds it and blocks. He can do it. I think so. I mean, yeah, it's, it's like Dalton, but everyone seems like a feature fan of character, right? Like, if you beat me, if you open me up twice, I die. Man, that makes it nice. Man, this guy was good at blocking. That was a really tight little command grab, too. Good. The hesitation on the overhead got him. Good dust. Block the double overhead. I haven't blocked that kid yet. I think we can just super him down. Mm, that sucks. He's got like a millimeter of health. Okay. The air grab doesn't really seem like a good answer. I, I haven't been able to get air grabs to work. I haven't gotten air grabs to work for me. Oh, but when it works. Okay. He was gonna do it! Oh no! There's no way he'll do another one. Okay, he was gonna though, but he got burst. Those were the movements of a man who was gonna grab again. Mm hmm? Hmm. That jab didn't really reach off of the command grab, that's right. Wow, he's got a combo of that? Oh no, I think he dropped something. But it looks like he's got the round. Unless that happens. That combos? Oh, wow, wait. No, that can't kill. I don't think. Mm hmm. Hard knockdown. Just gotta guess. Oh, that feels bad. What is the answer? Man. Duel 1. I feel bad that he can be heard clearly from where they're playing, like, I don't want to talk too much, just back nobody. Oh. 
I think so. I mean, I think, well, you can see a lot of people who are like a few steps away from perfecting their game plan and flowchart. Like, this author was really clean. There's just a few transitions and strings where I don't think uh, he's ready to convert off of optimally yet. But this is, everyone's found it. No one who comes to his vocal is like complete crap. I would never say. It's a fast game. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, there's nothing off that dab? Oh, wow! Kind of a tick throw, yeah. Overhead into throw. That sucks. You know, you can FD the return part of that axle move, and it'll actually bring you closer to him, close enough to punish in some cases. Yeah, I guess it's just how the pushback from the hit really works in the moment, but it's uh, just a little tip. Yeah, I think you I think you can actually run the airspace for kind of free. I don't think Axel has anything that can hit him up there consistently, right? That's why you see him, I think, going for the hit. Oh, that's a combo? That's weird. Yeah. Yes, yeah, it doesn't reach, it doesn't reach. It's too far. Yeah, Zato actually has some really good air normal. Just that little dab can beat even like hits jump dab, I think. That would have been a full combo with the ball break. That would have been rough. Oh, word! I can't say I've ever punished off screen, but Vice. Vice that can. You can kill it. Damn. In this? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This round is cleaner. But we'll see. Oh, that's at a counter. But nope. Mm -hmm. No. Both command grab with. Mm. Wow! Look at that! Look at that clean air movement though. He's stopping this short and then gets hit with the command grab. That feels bad. That's nope. Did that combo? No. Oh, I wonder if I don't think it absorbs super. Yeah, that sucks. Yeah. Air to air, push back full screen. Ready with the air throw this time. Mm, he tried to set up that counter shadow, but. I really like uh, some random though. He's very patient. His discipline with blocking is good. He's hitting all these right buttons in neutral. Oh, whipped command throw. I feel bad. That was really clean, though. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. My man playing Axel has the hitbox. I didn't see that. Really? I really want a hitbox in this game. Yo, dude. How do you uh, set up those air throws? Louder or this is good? Okay.
I gotta get Good luck, man. Oh, are you going to commentate too? Yes, okay, okay. <laughs> all right, all right. Your boy, uh, your boy, newspapers. If we're looking at this racket, we got. Um, wait a minute. Wait, am I supposed to play someone? And like, who the heck is C equals V? Well, I wish I knew. Who's? I don't care. You know, what? unless they call. Yeah, if they see you on the mic, they should know. Yeah, they they see they know where I am. They know where to find me. <laughs> All right, so we got uh. We got Soul versus, uh, hold on a second, we got Soul versus, uh, is, uh I think his name is Joey? Soul, I Soul versus, where this is mm -hmm. Soul, yeah, Joey versus Soul. Okay, okay, okay. So, Soul, uh, Soul's my boy, I brought him, he's first I'm here, playing Strap It Off. Uh, wait, can I, he wait, can you turn up his, can you turn up his mic? It might just be the way it's placed. Is it better? Like, alright, so you can hear right. me? Yeah, I can hear right, you, cool, 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 cool. So, uh, Soul plays Potemkin and Chip. Soul bad guy. Soul plays with Temkin and Chip. Yes. The guy's name is Soul. His name, his tag is Soul. Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, I know, right? It's confusing. That's. I thought for a second I was like, <laughs> for a second I was like, wait a minute, how is his name? All right. <laughs> Mad anyway. confusing. Anyway. Um. Oh. Yeah. That's uh. Why do I have to fight Vice? I'm upset. You gotta fight Vice. In losers, yeah. Oh, okay. Well, I mean, good luck to that. I. I Dual one. Ah, okay, so we're so gonna get a chip for the Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, so we're playing, feeling out the neutral a little bit. I see it approaching with the JS. So I'm not, uh, I the only thing I know about this matchup is that Chip gets Twitter clipped a lot by Soul. Oh, yeah, of course. Uh, it's like Soul counters Chip once and then he just explodes. Let's see this. She's okay. Okay, I got him, got him with the overhead. Yes, he does. He had to face right in this corner. Nice counter kill. I like that. Right out of there. Okay, cool. I go for a wall button. This is the first time. We're out of the corner, back to play neutral. Okay. Alright, so we have. You know, feeling out the neutral. I'm, you know. Okay, nice 5H anti air. Didn't expect that to be the anti air option. We'll go for a 6B. Yeah. Okay. He's got him in the corner. So, he's trying to stagger him with the uh, FS, but like, you know, I guess he was trying to fuzzy jump outside. Okay, the nice pressure, nice pressure. We're going to see a DP. We're going to see a DP. DPRC? Anyone? I want to do it. I want, I, I, you think, you think what happened, but he just, he's just for a special pressure. Now you get a corner. So we, got, we got a DP from uh, go. <laughs> Soul, but um, really channel, channeling Soul. <laughs> anyway. Okay, nice. Let's get that pressure. Boom, boom. No, so you got that You have to respect that. You got to stay there and block. Yep. Honestly, like, FD and Soul is such a good thing. When he's, like, mid screen, mid screen. Because at least you can, for my character, you can back dash it. Um, Fudge jump, pulsing that situation. Also, push it so far away so you can kind of react a little bit easier. He's going to run up and continue. Okay, nice hands there. You want to see the at all, though. Oh, oh, damn it. Okay. Alright, so he's got no burst. Ooh, he's got no burst, and if Joey finishes this, he'll go into round two with all those resources. Oh, yo, oh, oh, fuck. Bro. Oh, Joey looks at me, he's like, yeah, I did. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I does it. I does it. I press that. Okay. Oh, could have been. Okay. Okay. Okay, send the block there. Oh, he said, he said, we can reach it for a group. I mean, we can reach it for a group. I got the command, guys. Oh, so now he's reading the pressure. Okay. Are we going to do a DP? I want to, I want to. I want to see him whip it. Like just let it rip. Oh, okay, so 5k. He's got 5k on lock. 
Oh yeah, so this is a new thing. Um, if you hit the clone, Chip takes damage. Really? Yeah. So that's how that, that that's how the interaction happened. All right, so oh, okay. we're heading into next round. I mean, next next game. Round start. You know, they both move their moves, and all right, I like this pressure. Except these areas to escape. Yeah, yeah, that Great first. Yeah, let's see that pressure. Nice overhead. He's gotta get some. Uh... Oh. Okay. I like that. I like that choice. You get something off there. Oh. Ooh, gotta finish. Them. Gotta eat your breakfast. Gotta. I mean, gotta finish your breakfast. Ordered it, you got it. Ooh, okay. Run up beta blade. Uh, oh, 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 he just did the Daigo? What? The Uma Shuma? He just did the Daigo? Daigo? He's not really looking at the Uma Shuma. I mean, I like the DP people on their own wake up, but like, you know, I'm not gonna do it in tournament. <laughs> oh, 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 was that a shitty? Was that a shitty? Oh, oh, come on, you saw, saw that DP. Oh, that would have been a dead trip. Soul's get hard, though. Oh, my God. We got, oh, okay, okay, okay. Alright, uh. Alright, and then end cutscene. Did you shake my hand? Did you shake my hand? Alright, so we got it's one to one right now, and Golden right now, look at Soul. Ninja. Stoic, stone face. So that. stoic, so stoic. He's just like, yeah, I did it. Oh, I saw, I saw. He just kind of moved his eyebrows, like, yeah, that's good. Alright, so let's see. He's running up with the five K. Honestly, um, I really need to watch more of this matchup. I would say control more space for gunplay, but due to how fast Chip is, it's kind of like a risk of jump over, jump from behind. All this extra damage is just getting kind of hit. Everything I deal with, like chips, putting you in the corner, everything. That's not a good time. Yeah, I agree. Me being, I'm, I'm just doing boomer logic right now. <laughs> I want to be here for that. Oh, that was a good okay. Nice uh, pressure. Oh, oh. It's a lot of straight hits from the chip. But not really that many first. Okay, he did the gunflame wire seat, or I mean, well, it's not gunflame wire seat. <laughs> Ooh, okay, well, what we got here? And round is going to Soul Okay. I feel like right now just having a hard time hitting Soul down. That's what they say that he lost Yo, I don't know why that hits. That hits vicious. That hits. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, okay. So, oh, right oh. back into his favor. Just, oh my god. All right, so it's last. Oh, he shook his head. He's like, yeah, yeah, I did it. That's some confidence right there. Oh, it's like, okay, okay. Take All right, let's see this. All right, so same same situation as last time, just being stuck in the corner and. Okay, okay. All right, I like that. Got the tip of the Nikes. Okay, okay. Oh, okay, nice burst, nice burst. And he made him use 50 meters. Oh, well, actually, no. I mean, he still got another. got it all right back. Okay. Oh, come on. Uh-oh, uh-oh. 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 Oh, Oh, he yeah, take. He <laughs> I like that. I like that. Okay, I I don't know. I agree with that. Agree. No, no, no. It's not that I don't agree. I didn't know if Joey was just pausing there, waiting for it. That would be funny. Okay, okay. Okay. No, oh, Joey. Joey. Joey, give you. Joey, give you. Okay. Oh, and the slap. <laughs> <laughs> I just and wanted that's to. How he I just wanted to. Set? Oh. oh my god. Oh my god. What a oh set! Oh my god! Yeah, I love how I love how I'm just like so I'm so emotional right now. And Joe, Joey's just like, yeah, I did. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. He just looks back. He's like, yeah. That's I, the set. Jesus. Wait, hold on a second. Where am I supposed to? You 
play. Some guy named C equals V. I don't know. Dude, I don't know. But I know your second C this round, right? Who the heck is who the heck is C oh. equals V? I wish I could tell you. Yo, you play future? Oh wait, no, homie playing future? I never knew future plays this game. I know I do. Huh? Oh, oh, I gotta play. My Uh, I'm gonna I'm come and do this while I wait. Oh, I have a map? Like this? Alright. Oh man. Sorry? Oh. Duel one. Let's rock. Go shoot. Do 
Duel 2. Let's rock!
I really can't say for us to do papers. His conversions of even one hit all into RC was so beautiful to me. Being able to take corner carry easily from mid screen, be able to corner carry from from mid screen all the way to the corner, and even able to almost get the the wall break for a good positive bonus, while also having C, C equals V, C equals V being able to fight his way out of the corner, knowing where to space him out, press buttons. And applying that pressure because you could see fresh new papers whenever sequence view was applying that great block string making sure he couldn't get in run up on him or apply that hard aggression hard mix that Millie loves to do he was kind of struggling but sequence V also on the other hand was having a hard problem keeping keeping fresh new newspapers in that corner allowing him to be able to jump out at any time he wanted to Check, check. Angie Mito. Check, 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 check. Right. We're back with another match. Let's see who's up. Ramlethal Valentine. Holy Blue Ridge Cheesecake. Before we get into it, aren't they going to be doing a button test? Oh, a Ramlethal, Ram Kana Lethal, and Angie Mito stirring up in the pot with his giant fans and dance moves let's see how this goes now i can say on these two characters it's Mankind two whole different worlds you have ramito wanting to so apply that good screen control making sure you aren't able to get hit Heaven and the moment you try hell. to make a move let's say trying to jump in the air or even just dash so up so and using her swords to really keep you out and drag you to the corner and it's just start a really strong conversion off and even setting up to on burst baits, especially when getting hit by that sword on the wall, bursting on that really, really isn't a good idea, like I said. Let's get in. Leave your cheesecake on man. Tommy on ramp. He's like, he breaks wall tone. Down to the corner, and Homie just walks <laughs> calmly out the corner. Does not care about what you have to say. Oh, but he gets hit with the overhead. It seems like both of them have already popped their burst. But they're trying to really keep each other, each other in one confined space. Though Homie takes a lot more damage than Uber. Trying to find his way out. Ooh, a pop of the arts. Uber. 
one more time for the Super Saiyan and the EP Super for Ramatov, but does not care. We're just going to grab. What are you doing? Let's hop right into the second round. Ooh, nice jump back down. Trying to come respect, trying to see what he's going to do. Get that spacing. Jumping up and down. Using her giant sword button. Well, Apply some good pressure and spacing though. Making sure he isn't able to make any sudden movement. And as I was saying, Remico using her swords and range, being able to apply that pressure, get a nice conversion off the wall with the swords and break and break it and that just won the round. It seems like it's, it's one one now. What can they do to change it around? In my opinion, I think you have to really be careful. It seems like Homie is leading him, biding his time. A bit. Just trying to get a clear understanding of what Uber's gonna do and how to respond to it. But Uber, it seems, was at first trying to jump around and get in. But getting back on the offensive again, losing the corner again. Nice go burst! And an RC, purple RC, I think that might have been an accident or just a bit too late to get, the, to get that combo. Just fighting her way out, only takes this match right here. That was a good fight. A good fight out the corner it did. Uber really was trying his best to apply that pressure. Get past those giant sewers that everybody has a huge deal against the Ramathal. But it was really just taking too much damage, throwing out a lot of buttons to let him capitalize on such a big opportunity to post him. And a burst! And the wall break. Like I said earlier, Ramberthal's sword, when you burst them, you actually don't hit it. So you have to actually wait for the combo or wait for Ramberthal to be a bit closer. Especially when the sword is close. How was it? I drown, but you know, it'd be like that. It happens. Well, we got another quick wall break. It looks like Homie's just now dominating Uber right now, taking full control of the match, making sure he has full pressure, full aggression and pressure, not letting him breathe. But it looks like Uber's really trying to bring it back, push her into the corner. Popping his burst. Ajay and wants to be in your face at all times. True. But Rimethal wants you to stay away at all times. I don't know. She's pretty close to me now. Well, yeah. But a lot earlier, um, Homie was showing just great screen control. As so, using her giant swords and gigantic hitboxes. Capitalizing on different pokes from Uber. Especially since Uber was throwing out a few different moves. Throwing out few Fujin and being able to just... Wanting to get in, but again, homie throwing out his swords and even catching off the break, the burst with the with throwing his swords to the wall. Really great play style right there. A little bit of criticism for the Anji, more Fujin. I don't know about that. The Fujin got him in, but it also got him out, so he needed to Fujin even more. <laughs> Stop! You can't solve everything with Fujin. <laughs> I mean, clearly they thought so since they made Anji that way. <laughs> I see what we what I think a lot of Anjis probably wish for is guard point right now. But I'm not complaining. Yeah, my thing with Anji is that apart from my previous complaints that you're very <laughs> well acquainted with, it's just that yeah, spin can get you in, but spin can get you hit at the same time. You proc it, you get grabbed, or get beat by a faster normal. But if you whiff it, that's even worse. And just, they need to really tighten the window between Fujin and its follow-ups for him to really capitalize on landing that big counter hit or that big Fujin hit. Yeah. Because apart from the sweep, his other options are unsafe at best. Okay. Yeah. It makes, I, I think uh, one thing she they should definitely do, uh, his, his low option from Fujin, I believe, maybe make that a bit safer on block because it could really change the tide while not so much he can immediately press the button, more so he just loses his turn at this point, at that point. And it would be a lot better for Andre's sake, because going for that low, only having having multiple options, but 
having two of your options not be the safest thing to do mm -hmm. wouldn't really isn't really helpful. It makes sense for his overhead to be really minus, being able to have the opponent capitalize off it. But the low, is, I feel like she just he should just generally just lose his turn after that. Yeah. The other thing with the low is that they need to decrease the window between the input and the move actually coming out. Make it more airtight, as they say. Understandable. Well, actually, you got to keep in mind, though, it, it, it does confirm. So. It does confirm, yes, but anyone with a DP can beat it if they time it well enough. As goes for the rest of his follow -ups. The overhead, obviously. You know, that's an obvious one. It's an overhead. Yeah. You should be able to DP out of it. But the fake out can be DP or grabbed. The fans can get DP'd or grabbed if you're quick enough. Anji just... You have to work twice as hard with Anji as with most of the other cast. He's trying to play Shroud. But, oh, another ramp. Oh, no, they probably don't want to do button checks. Looks like this one is Phantom versus Homie? Homie the Homie? Homie the Homie. Ramlethal Valentine. Ah, I see. Dual Ram? Ram kind of leaves. But it ain't Valentine's Day. Nope, not February. <laughs> uh, it is blazing hot outside. And we cooking <laughs> with Strive, striving for greatness. Nice Ram versus Ram matchup. Honestly, I don't see a lot of these. It's always Ram versus somebody else. Yeah, I've never seen the Ram Ditto that much before. But I do want to know how well she plays into herself. Yeah. I feel like it's more, I guess, a war of attrition, so to say, because they both want to use their long Ooh, nose to be able to capitalize on each other. Let's rock. But it's just who's going to throw that long nose? <laughs> As I say. I was going to bet one of them was going to throw standing S as soon as the game started. My money was on jumping at S. <laughs> but it seems like Phantom being able to jump out the corner and Homie running out of the corner immediately. Homie already taking the 20% of his health. Phantom, big damage, big numbers. Yep. Homie and with the grab. And it seems like they're really, like I said before, it's a war of attrition. They're really just both trying to find that one hit. Knowing each other is going to throw out that move, trying to bait each other out and capitalize. They know what nice. they want. Ram with those only want one thing, and it's disgusting. Jump S. <laughs> oh, immediately R, triple RC. That's the whipping move. Don't lose a word of her sword. Phantom backing up. Get backed up into the corner. Oh, it's like delicious the disjoints. The dust. And is he going to bait the burst? The burst Ooh. has been baited. Let's see. Ooh. They're both, again, trying to get that one hit. Homie's still having his burst. No, 100% beater. While Phantom, only 50%. Did the wall spark help? Yeah. Huh. When you get wall splat, uh, you can act, it takes like a little bit of damage. It's like Tekken. Mm. So. And here you go. Making full use of the jump light as an anti air. Okay. JP, my bad. Phantom is the white one. Homie's the green one. Homie just got wall broken. Mortal Bato is losing a chunk. Oh my word. 70? Oh! Nice! Yeah, a nice orange RC. That move is actually minus on block. I believe with certain characters you can kick and you can do probably light kick. No, let me not say light kick. 2K or maybe even jab it out into a special move or jab it out into 6B for a little bit of damage. Knock your way out. Man, dual one. Seems like we bent him to that first match. Only with the back dash to get some space. All the jabs. Nice little petty hits, Blue jabs and kicks going down now. Immediately, I'm not sure I oh. agree with it. Ooh. Big damage, almost broke the wall. Nice grab, low. Only with a great response. Phantom jumping his way to the corner. Said, "I don't want to be here." To the backyard with you. <laughs> nice low grab, kick through. What did Phantom quickly establishing? That this is his world we're living in it, killing with a wall break. Yo. What I wanna know what button homie hit right there. Or like I can understand why he didn't okay. <laughs> I I did, definitely did not agree with that one. Yeah, uh so again and again he probably wanted to wanted to get him off. 
try and make sure you can get some more pressure. But it looks like Homie is really getting Phantom back for all those amount of times in the past match. He was locked up in jail. This is Rikers Island. Stay inside. This is, this is a high school multiple choice test. Pick an answer. Make sure it's the right one. Oh, Phantom fighting his way out. Getting the knockdown. Back dash. Trying to beat the throw. Ooh, getting a nice counter. Will he get the wall break? Oh, letting it un Another wall break. <laughs> Ooh, a little bit of health homie, homie is li living on right now. Seems like Phantom's trying to wait it out. And the kill. Phantom taking a clean 2 all over Homie. You could really tell that Homie was really trying to work his way out in those situations. Um, that one burst we did see, I'm not going to say I agree with it, but I get what he was trying to do. He wanted to <laughs> fight his way out because he hasn't been really having a good time, especially when using his burst to try to get out of combos. My general rule of thumb with burst is that I make sure they're at least like on top of me mm -hmm. so that the burst actually knocks them away. Even if they block it, I have an idea of what I want to do next. But I feel like he got hit by the 2k, kind of panicked a bit, and then went for the burst that's just like, let me out, I want to breathe, I don't want to be here. Yeah. So... I, th I feel like I can definitely say uh, Phantom's pressure and a lot of his great conversions are pretty great, especially having getting that one combo. I think it was like 75%? Mm-hmm. Off, off a wall break and super and leaving him with that little bit of life? Yikes. He sees his opportunity. True, true. Really good conversions. I can definitely say Ramathal as a character, she's not so, but like she... She plays in a way that makes her super strong, allows her to take control of a lot of the matches, especially certain characters that don't have ways really to respond to her pressure. Yeah, not even good it's just ways to respond to her pressure, but like good ways of getting in. Mm -hmm. Let's say like you may have like a projectile, you may have uh, I mean like Leo, you may have a move where a stance where you can just parry her move or just walk up slowly, but like. With, let's say Giovanna, Gio can when Gio gets in, she's gonna rain, yeah. rain all havoc. But the problem is, Gio giving in against Ram. Right. Ram's buttons are too big and then just they're too disjointed. Even if she throws them out, there's no way to like you know counter poke it. Yep. Like uh, even even if she were to lunge against like a far slash, I'm pretty sure Gio would lose that. Yep. It's like when you have to deal with those type of that matchup uh, with Ram is. Instead of playing Strive, you're playing Red Light, Green Light. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Every time she throws out her sword, that's the Green Light. <laughs> when she gets it back, that's the Red. Yeah. All right. Best of luck. Smash. Go take care of Smash. Yeah. It'd be like that. I should I should I not go for Tenken, yeah. You dare to enter the mayhem. All right, for this next match, we have C equals V versus KLG Satsu, loses round Leo two. Leo White Fire. Hmm? Kai Kis. So you'll be playing Kai Kis. Interesting to see how this will go.
mankind. Duel one. Let's rock. <laughs> 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 You dares to enter the Leo White Bag. Alright, getting into this loser's round two, we have KOG Satsu again versus CB. Satsu playing Leo, CB playing Kai. So a matchup you don't get to see a lot often. And all the time the that I play Guilty Gear, at least. Or hell. This game will never not look beautiful. <laughs> Satsu establishing space already going in. Kai responding accordingly. He's seen this one too many times. Leo with the other effective response. Big overhead into Slash. Already breaking the wall. Satsu quickly establishing that he's not playing around. He wants in. He wants your wrist cage all the way up immediately. Responding with appropriate anti airs. Unrelenting offense. The wrist cage on Kai is looking ridiculous right now. Kai fighting for his leg to get up the corner. Responding with 2P. A big counter far slash. Red RC into the dust, but Satsu blocks it. A big throw is to set up in the OP fireball. Another grab set up into the OP fireball once again. Satsu testing the approach. Gold burst from Satsu. 6 feet Dire Eggclat waiting for a response with CB closing out the round. Satsu moving in. Already mounting pressure. CB's biding his time, waiting to get in. Heavy Sonic Bull from Satsu allowing him to get in. Already mounting pressure. Overhead into the grab. Back turn stance whips the command grab. CB is responding accordingly. Satsu with another grab. Ooh, with counter from Satsu. Allowing CB to set up some nice little neutral Oki Zeme. 6 feet Dire X Lab pushing into the corner. That 5k setting is a great medium. The burst from CB to get out of the pressure. 6 feet Dire X Lab. Stun Dipper into RC. Baits the burst. CV taking the first game. Satsu definitely has an easy time with the offense. That 2S from Kai is massive. Hops over the fireball. He's facing out his normals. Ooh. Nice come from Inzatsu, but oh. goes from Kai, purple RC, offense, 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 that's Leo's entire game, play 2k to 5k, blocks it, gets a massive hit into the RC, hits the dust but doesn't charge it, he wants to lock you down and make sure you know it, putting him in the blender, getting grabbed, wrist gates at an all time high, Oh. Kai responding accordingly. The first DP from Satsu the entire game into the back turn overhead. Satsu closing up the round with amazing offense, as always. 
Let's see how CB adjusts. With the back turn into the overhead. With the huge command gram. The slammer. Oof. Into the 2S loops. The near bonus. An amazing burst from CV. CV quickly establishing that he has presence at mid range. Lil struggling to respond accordingly for the, the offense. Counters Hista with a throw into the low. Satsu taking this game over CV. He do be vibing though. Dual one. Let's rock. Side switch baiting the burst. Unfortunately not capitalizing and getting a big combo off of it. Kudre Ekla finds its mark. Ooh, the counter stance not really good against projectiles. Dire Ekla putting him in a shock state. Satsu struggling to get in. Here we go into the back turn. Into the huge tick throw. Red RC into the corner loops. Drops the air throw from Satsu. Satsu is making it known that he wants you to block. He wants that risk gauge all the way up. Red RC and he closes out the round. CB quickly catching up. Into the stun dipper. Massive combo and shock state for CB. With an appropriate grab from Satsu. The guard break from the overhead. Leo does as Leo does. Swinging hitting buttons. The stun dipper into the RC, but Satsu bursts it. Whiffing the direct by backing up. Kai finds himself again and once again in the corner. We haven't seen a single DP out of CV yet. It's also quickly making him know that he wants your risk to go all the way up, taking advantage of it. CV responds accordingly with a throw into the OP Fireball. 6k. Full burst, but Satsu blocks it. And Satsu takes the set. Leo is definitely a monster when it comes to offense. No matter what position he's in, no matter what stance he takes, Leo wants to get in and he wants to stay in. Leaving little room for error when defending against him. When his back is turned, he somehow gets even better. Gets a huge disjointed with far slash, an amazing overhead with heavy slash. 5k because of near unreactable low. To top it all off, he gets a sick command grab. Next match, we have some random from New York versus KOG Satsu. Axel Lowe, Leo Whitefag.
This will definitely be an interesting matchup to say nonetheless. Leo versus Axel. One wants to get in, one wants you to stay away. As we've seen earlier, some random from the wise Axel can be pretty devastating under the right circumstances. He guesses right, you're taking a huge Man chunk of damage. damage. Dual one. Let's rock. Ah, 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 quickly establishing his presence. I want you to stay away. I know what you want to do. I know who you are. I know your objectives in life, and I want to prevent you from getting there. But I suppose it's not too First from Satsu already. He doesn't need whatever damage the action is about to dish out. This is where Satsu is going to shine the brightest. I mean, Axel in the corner is Leo. Making him stay there, but Axel's buttons are good enough to get him off all the burst from, from, from random. Appropriate response from Axel. Ooh, and he is going to eat all this damage from Leo. Listing the wall break into the reverse overdrive. And random closes out the round. Let's see if Satsu can make the adjustment this next round. Two agents of the bomber. Full screen command round. Satsu wanted to get in. Axel not letting him. Random knows what his game plan is. Two agents of the back turn. This is the amazing damage with the mix of the command throw from Satsu. This is the best in the close of the round. Oh, unfortunate, the autocorrect causing it to whiff. Well, Satsu closing out the round with a couple of slashers. Second neck. Random wanting him to stay away, but Satsu not really caring either way. With the full speed command grab. Okay, so basically really for what Satsu's gonna do. Amazing reaction. Gets the burst. Satsu confirming off of the 2S. He wants Axel to stay there. He wants him to stay split, making him pay rent in this corner. With the huge counter from Far S. Satsu immediately capitalizing on it. Triple Roman cancel, but misses it. Axel responds to the throw. Hits the dust, but doesn't charge it. With the full speed command grab from Random to close out the game. Man. Dual one. Let's rock. Okay, Satsu can make the adjustments necessary. Huge 2S. And then even bigger combo from Axel. What a confirm. Seems like Random's taking advantage of the fact that Satsu's taking his time to think whenever he's outside of his optimal range. Satsu fighting for his life, wanting to approach. With a huge gold burst from Satsu. Into the run-up PRC grab. Huge overhead. Into the wall break. I personally would have supered there since I had the meter for it. Sniping him with a 2S. Yellow Roman cancel. And to close out the round. Dual two. Let's rock. Satsu on the offensive. And then testing out some pokes. Challenging Satsu's button. Ooh, that proves to be unwise. Satsu with a huge confirm. It's a huge, huge damage. Can you get the wall break? But instead lets him go for the wall mix-up. Into the grab. Into another grab! It's time to slam down. Random with the anterior 5 feet, but Satsu not taking Kali through. He grabs him out of the reversal. Into the bomber. Huge damage for Axel, even getting a wall break. 5 feet to D. Satsu bursting out. And Random closes it out with a giant air S. Taking it home and advancing on.
honestly. Uh, it was a fun match. I can't even be mad. I, I tried to adapt uh, to his playstyle, especially for Axel, which I, I personally find that's one of my hardest matchups to face. You and a lot of people. And as, as you, have you heard me say before, fighting Atsu uh, as a Leo player, for me, in my opinion, it's like playing double dutch. <laughs> <laughs> I can't really use my projectiles the because the, the sickle, I can't, I really don't know the name of the move, but it was one of the moves he kept using to create the explosion behind me. That special move actually beats my projectile, so I'm really forced to play a grounded game, try and I, I see I can try and capitalize on his normals especially, or if I do block one of his chains, chains I can use my Berserk S slash. Hmm. And, uh, it doesn't help that Leo has limited movement options compared to the rest of the guys. Some characters have like a run, like a sprint. Yeah. Yours, you just have a standard you know, Street Fighter S dash. And Axel is kind of free for him at that point. <laughs> <laughs> can't approach from the air because of 2S, can't go on the ground because of the... You know, the 2-H or the command grab or the Axel Bomber. Well, not the Axel Bomber, the, the, the Killer Queen Bomb. <laughs> what, what I really uh, find with uh, Axel, what is the, what is the not, not gonna say the best way to deal with them, is definitely, is definitely uh, trying to bait out his normal. It's trying to make him use a certain move. Make him think you're gonna like jump, use 2-H, or make him think you're gonna run up and use B. It's a, it's a really good way to try Beat him out and capitalize, capitalize on the plate. Let's get into this match. A Duke versus Lily, a fresh Duke paper. Back at it again. You saw him early in the tournament. He's really still strong, but now he's going to get chipped. AKA, he's real harder. He's definitely the battle of the lightest blenders in this game. Yo, how, how blended do you want? Do you want a. Uh, do you want ninja blend or hair blend? <laughs> One offers the, the hair milkshake special. That round went by so fast, I couldn't keep up. Honestly, <laughs> we were having that whole conversation. I think that it, that's just the nature of these two characters. Chip is just a fast character in general. It's hard to keep up. And Lilia, when she starts to get her mix down, it's hard to really keep your eyes on it. On the characters, like the uh, I, I see it as a really good example of shit being super bad. The match is, was a bit even in health, but it seems like the match, the rest of the paper is trying to find a footing right now that I'm putting back in. Getting even knocked down again by the ship. Why are you to get him out? Really good play. So, first of all, he's using the meter. Can he get the ball? Not quite. The super Still. failing to close out the round. Still got his burst. Pedro Parker about to get his burst back. He can actually get hit by a jab. Oh. And the round loss. What I was going to say was he can actually get hit by a jab and he can reverse if he oh, wanted yes. to. He'd still be able to live, but closing out the round is fresh new paper. Let's rock. Oh, right now. Definitely trying to get the. Lilia really not falling for any of these command grabs. You know, that's the online killer right there. They, they put you in knockdown, run up, 5k, 5k command grab. Or 5k command grab. This is so annoying. This is really the online killer right there. Oh, the sick confirm into the super to close out the round. You think he beat me? I think he tried. Okay. So that's the only reason why I, I think he did hit by that. Yeah. Oh, that's trying to beat you again. But yeah. you super out here making headlines with Milia. Yeah. From Times Square into a coffee shop, this trip is getting thrown around a few right now. He's been really trying to fight back. But you know, first two is just able to deal with almost any situation. Major is throwing at him. Just no like plot that. armor for Chip here. Ooh, oh, just like that. Well played by the Chip by Pedro Parker, really trying his best to get out the pressure and fight his way to even getting close to getting around where it wasn't enough. Fresh newspapers, Billy was just too strong, too yeah. strong in the pressure and able to just jump out the corner. For some reason, why Why are we just, why, I'm, why I'm, I'm saying we, why are they just letting the million jump out? I don't Keep know. Locked down. I haven't seen a single DP out of Chip that entire round. No, I'm not going to say, I'm going to say that because I feel like 
the times he did try to DP, the disc was thrown. And yeah. he lost to the disc. So I, I think one thing he should start using a little bit more that I've learned, certain characters you can 6P Melia while she's uh setting her. up her disc. Yep. So if she's right above you, she'll block, she can either shoot. If she blocks it, you you don't get hit, but you just lose your turn. Hmm. So you have to hold the mix again. If she doesn't, you get your turn back, and you get to play the game. Hopefully. Yes, <laughs> <laughs> it was a really good match to really this match too well. Uh, let's see, what do we have next? Looks like Fresh Newspaper is actually climbing up. That was the semi winner semi-finals. So now we're about to... We're at winner's finals with Phantom versus Newspapers. Uh, and then I believe the next match is going to be the move round uh, four. I believe. Let's see, let's see. Uh, bet. You know, modify mod uh, uh, do a little scrub vent venting real quick. I won't ping scrub quotes. <laughs> this, is a, this is a scrub quote safe space. You think? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, uh, one thing I can definitely say that in this game, what where I play Leo, I find certain matchups where I get spaced out, like let's say Nago. At the beginning of the match, it see, it feels even, nice spot, 50-50, anything can happen. As the match progresses, progresses and as Nago like starts to gain buggy, or like where another character might start to gain the momentum or mechanic, like Ram with her swords, it starts to get harder to necessarily get in. Mm -hmm. But it, it pushes it pushes a different level of instead of wanting to always be on top of them, pushes to a level of patience of being able to deal with other characters like that. Let's say, mm -hmm. again, well, how I had to face Axu. Having that patience, being able to know where to take those certain steps, where to throw out those certain buttons sometimes, really helps with dealing with like, a lot of these matchups. Mm -hmm. While on the other side, you have matchups where here's the scrub quote for Zemke. <laughs> 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 but Temkin. Oh, here we go. There is no patience. Here we go. <laughs> he waits for you and only you. <laughs> you. He will patience. Listen, but Temkin is honest. He's a hard worker. He's a loyal soldier for Zep. He's out here <laughs> obtaining the grain, bro. But Temkin ain't done nothing but break my spine. <laughs> I don't know. I, you listen, may... listen, listen. You allowed yourself to get grabbed, sir. <laughs> like, if you get grabbed by Pop Buster, you just allowed it to happen. I allowed it. Allowed it to happen. I understand. So, 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 me doing the DP and getting Pop Buster out my DP. Mm hmm. That's you let it happen. Yo. You let it happen. <laughs> you chose an option, and I responded. This is a multiple choice test, bro. This is a knowledge check. True or false? <laughs> Will you be grabbed? <laughs> the answer was true. <laughs> no, you understand. Both true and false. There's not true and false. It's grab and get grabbed. The game was rigged from the start. Yo, we all should have known. To the <laughs> this was his true vision. This was the original vision. Yo, watch. Give it, give it season two. Potemkin's just pop busters just gonna get your armor. <laughs> Listen. Dorime. The 6P Dorime, bro. <laughs> you you, you gotta respect it. Valentine. Uh, maybe. Me. I, I respect, like, Hammerfall. That's kind of, to me, that's a little bit scary. I, I don't want to get scared. It's scarier than it was in Exor, because in Exor, it only went, like, what, half screen, three fourths of the screen? But in this game, you're not safe. You, you're, you're way over there. You're way over there. I don't need a Metro card. I don't need an automobile. I, I take the Leg Express, bro. I just. Uh, Man said, I'm down the block. Where you at? <laughs> No. You see, if you look at Potemkin's character design, you could actually see he has wheelies. He has heelies on. <laughs> that allows him to hammer fall precisely to your location. You get a ping from your phone, Potemkin is going to your location. It's not that he wants to know. He already has it and he's coming. <laughs> and you look up, and by the time you look up, it's too late. You're already in, you're like you're already the meat in the number sandwich. I think the only thing worse than that society. is uh, Karakin to so Fafnir, but like, oh. on themselves, Woo! They blame I'm telling how to do that, it's over. Uh, but let's actually get into this nice match. Leo versus Ramathal. 
I'm a hung a little bit by it. Let's go, Leo. <laughs> but I do want to see how he plays this you matchup. I to say this is a difficult matchup again for Leo. Having to deal with those swords. But when he does get in, it's a wrap for Ram. Having to deal with Until she gets a super. Dual one. But I believe it's, at that point, it's just a bait. It's a bait in my box. No. That's a death thunder immediately answering the bell. No. Here comes the grab on the cross up. This is the tick bro. Red Thunder. Trying to find some pressure. Jumping and getting Oh, missing the dust. Oh, going off the heavy boom. Oh. Regular side, to left. Oh, another reportedly to the overhead. Another boom. He's like he's trying to find different ways. Getting ooh, the tick the one. Come on and slam. Oh, can't you get the combo? The wall is actually gonna break. Yes. One thing you actually know, and I, I think I'm not sure if this is all for command, for all command grab. But once you RC by the wall, about three to four of you actually break. So you get a good amount of damage, but just not a full combo that you might want. Right then, trying to get command of the match. This is very fast. Hot Tetsu. Look on the chest in the water. Honestly, that's the corner. If I drop that, Try to get another back into the corner with the spectre. The dust. Big can't, dust. Can't even see it. Oh. I guess, the two. I guess maybe he messed up. Uh, wanting to try and get more, more hits on the board. He's really still controlling the match. Two, taking three. He's a Thunder is using Leo's Fireball to really keep Ram at bay while at the same time getting a free approach. Also, capitalizing off those wounds and the damage he's doing. Petsu's getting running into them. Jumping at the overhead. Hitting another hard dust. Can you get this one more time? I woke up with heavy DP with the RC. Honestly, I can not think you do that. Yeah, I, I, honestly, I feel like Red Thunder should have either... Did a, I feel like you should have backdashed right there. It would have been a better option instead of throwing out the DP. Oh, you see, Red Thunder got an idea. He had a brain blast. Yep. Let's, Let's see the adjustment. Data acquired. Ooh, there's a corrupted download. He oh. got his info from LimeWire. Kidding. Trying to get out of the box. Right here. Burp. Quick burp from Tetsu. Getting a nice counter up from Tetsu. You can actually get a dash forward. He actually can get a really good confirm. Seems like he's actually jumping over. Avoiding danger. Going out to burp. Right there. Wow. He's got a big combo. He's got a big combo. He's got a big combo. But Red Thunder is RC trying to get some damage. And wake up super. Oh, we'll get the wall break. Doesn't look good for Red Thunder right now. Yeah. I, I, I will definitely say Red Thunder is doing really well using those wounds, making sure he's able to get some good, get good health off, trying to keep him out. Ooh. The DP got exploded by the projectile, literally. Into the back here. Nice. nice cross up. Ooh, going out to the, from the back to the stance. Actually, canceling the stance into a back dash. Oh. We're having right. damage for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Ooh, the huge overhead. Didn't get the conversion. Nice DP. He has his burst. Let's see what he's gonna do. He mediates the burst. I think he was not trying to take a chance at first, but Ooh, Beaver, what happen. an answer! Didn't what happen. an answer! Red Thunder really was trying. I feel like he didn't have a good enough patience to wait out that. Yeah. He, he was, it was a really good idea to immediately confirm and super off that crouching slash, but I feel like one thing, especially with fighting Red, you have to pay attention to our feeder. The moment you have 50, you should try and back off or give a little bit of bait because you can really just lose a match off that even no matter what yeah the frames the starting frames and the hip hops of mortal bottle is beyond this world True. it is 
actually insane how deep and how much that super does on its own. Like, it, I think that's what makes uh, Remco such a really like high character in, a, in a, probably a lot of people's tier list. Being able to apply pressure from such a far away, getting really easy, good conversions, especially get, being able to have uh, specials that if they burst, you can still convert them into another combo because they now they've wasted it. And then with the added bonus, yeah. uh, once she has 50 meter, you all your opponents have to actually be fearful of applying Oki, or you might lose either like 30 to 50 percent, depending on where you are on the on the stage. Just she's just one of those characters you have to play. You you have to choose and pick where you want to go all out, and mm -hmm. then be safe. Yeah, Remethal definitely, I think she has like that sphere of influence around her. Where there are certain ranges where she operates well, but you get her outside of it and she's already uncomfortable. She wants to get in, she wants to make it known that she has swords and she's going to swing them. Yep. But once you get in on that, it's pretty hard for her to do anything outside of her, you know, doing Mortal Lato or like YRC. Who dares to enter the mayhem? Let's see, we got another one. Fresh newspapers back up. Um, the sticks, then we got... Phantom. Ram this Lethal is now Valentine. winners final right now. Ram oh. yeah, I've seen a lot. There's been a lot of Ram with those today. See, I guess she might be slightly kind of lethal. She's very lethal. Yeah, so much Ram, they might call it eight gigs. Sixteen, actually. Each stick of Ram or her swords. She got eight <laughs> gigabytes on each sword. <laughs> I know a thing or two about computers, y'all. Yeah. <laughs> You build your first computer from the ground up, you, you pick up a few things along the way. Yeah. Nice, nice little fist bump, we get started. I, I feel like seeing how Fresh Newspeepers has been playing today, his melee is really aggressive. I think he can really take a good advantage on Phantom Ram. For the fact is, he's been really good at jumping out of the corner, getting out of those tough situations where Duel anybody one. else, if they they might be hit and dying for that. But not just for that. This Billy is like, you know what? I may be locked down, but I'm gonna break myself free to see if you like it or not. And I'm gonna start fighting. I see here. Into the battle, let us see. Yup. Getting a really great putting out of this phantom. Not letting overhead into the grab. There is no reason. The blender. Oh my god. This ain't Jamba Juice, baby. Oh my god. I know this thing. I know the Olympics is happening right now, but I didn't know this could be happening on Twitch. Dang. This is great. What an answer from newspapers. <laughs> Where you going? Come back here. Ooh. Broken neck. Oh. And Bad that. mode red RC. Instant overhead. I got hit two rounds ago, did you? Yo. <laughs> I'm just watching the Frisbee Duel fly right one. now. She's the can and she's the opener. Yeah. Yo. <laughs> that's, that's, that's what I'm watching right now. Yeah. Ramathal is a can of piss joints and Millie is the can opener. Yeah. <laughs> Here we have Benji trying to get back at the door tonight. Oh, not letting you have his this way this time. Oh. Portal bottle for the wall break. Whoa, I'm having a deja vu with reverse. Wasn't this like last round? had all that help, and Fanta was, seems like the tide is turned. Fanta is getting maybe a bit of a download. 25, 30% right now. I said 30% download. Yeah. This ain't Lincoln Park, not EXE, from LimeWire. This is, this is a fresh download. This is the Spotify. I'm about to listen to this on the train. Type beat. This is pure, raw data in its finest form. Fresh 
fighting back. Unfortunately, <laughs> misses the super. She really have fighting to get in. Ramathon not letting her. The overhead into the crowb. Really want to just not get put back in that corner. He knows that he has to take the ground, though. The match off the grip. Oh, yes. Yep. Perfect. Per what a response. What a response. And he knows it. Yeah. This man, newspaper. Dual one. Yeah. Fence Fresh about off him. the press. Yeah. And Fence is cutting those newspapers. Yeah. Millions <laughs> built like paper. <laughs> oh, with that help. I think she's one of the characters. I think Fence is going to show us that these newspapers are kind of you know, fake news. He seen through the lies. Extra, extra, really not about it. This makes the mic up right. This extra old conversion not really drops like a slippery little bit, but gets a grab. This is dumping out. I feel like fresh is trying to hold, hold down the corner. Instant overhead with a bad moon. And the wall breaks. Oh! Oh! He closed it out. All right, he closed it out. He finished his meal. He finished his meal. Let's rock. I thought he dropped it. That's scary. My word. You ever try smacking a fly with like a giant like newspaper? This, yeah. is, this is kind of what I'm experiencing right now. Instead of a giant newspaper, it's a giant sword. But uh, not like this. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, nice. Okay. Nice PRC. Oh, nice. Oh, oh, nice. Oh, but it trades. Yeah. Yeah. Nice versus the fans. Really versus off team. the table. Oh, with the yeah. trade. What hit? What hit basically right now? Huge counter hit. RC. Drops the combo. Oh, red blue paper. Yellow RC. Fence is not having it. Throwing out his sword. Out of the corner. Oh, my God. Fence. Fighting his way out, he did really well, but one last hit, that one last hit. Dual one. Two one. Let's rock. Not down the press the trying to all the all things What a confirm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Really is not having the best health of the game. It looks like a player is huge, baby. Could have been I was really smart after to set up the sword that way for the explosion to kind of cover his approach. Especially with the RC, go for overhead, low, and smooth. Really, truly ambiguous with the air grab. Another with grab. Another grab. Another one. <laughs> another one. <laughs> Let's see it. That's the first. Ooh, Phantom is not having it. He is like, I get it. You're aggressive. You having a bad hair day. Here's a bad sword day to go with it. I got the clippers. We're not having it. Nice. Dust card. 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 Nice. That is no damage, but that's a good spot again. Yeah, that is, that is the Maj. Yeah. The Maj. All, all the conditions, all the conditions. 
already swashed at that. Flipping Millie up like a pancake with her sword. Really? It's, it's really just present. Yeah. I mean, I didn't say a bit of the sword. I'm quite agree with the sword, though. Like Gets the grab. His presence is great, but I feel like he needs to take a better, better yeah. point. Better point to the point of the director. Yeah. 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 Drops the combo, but goes for the grab. Such the disc. I don't, I don't call it a drop combo. I call it an American reset. Benzo seems to struggle a lot with the instant overhead bathroom. Compressed uh, newspapers. Ooh, the low. Phantom taking it. Phantom moving on. Two grand finals. I Phantom, I like how he adapted over the course of the game. Taking in all the pressure and saying, okay, you're going to keep throwing this out. Well, I know what I can do here. I'm going to jump up. I don't have to really hold this all the time. I. It, it was a really nice look of improvement throughout the match to see. And yeah. Newspaper was really trying his best to keep her down. But I feel like he was taking a bit too many straight hits, especially with those counters. Mm -hmm. It wasn't good, good for him. Especially with Billy's health. Yeah. The name of the game in Guilty Gear, other than you know knowing your character and its buttons, improv. Improvisation. Knowing what to do when an opportunity is presented to you. Yeah. You get that straight 5K or 5P. RC. RC, convert, spend resources. You're going to get it back if you break that wall. If you stage transition, you're going to get that meter back anyway. Spend it. Yeah. Do super, do RC. You have options. I really I really do like how these people was using uh, one of Millie's supers. I believe it's this. The Beyblade, yeah. Yeah, plus applying that for pressure, making sure Gravithal is sitting there, if not even getting a straight hit, getting that nice wrist gauge so when she does get that hit, she's going to be doing like 40, 50, maybe even 60% damage, especially with that wall break. Really yeah. good option. Definitely his biggest strength is cashing out. Yeah. He knows when to cash out. He he likes to hold his cards, knows that poker night. He's got a full house. <laughs> he's just waiting for someone to call his bluff, and oh. then he lands it. It'd be uh, like that. Me? Is there a way? Can we probably like turn down the actual game value? No, because I think it's one PS4 for three monitors. So ah, yeah. Ooh, it's, not, it's not the worst thing in the world. I can deal with it. Ooh, I believe it's Pedro Parker versus Homie. Homie, I feel like I saw him earlier play. We did. He. What was he? What was he? Was he a Ram as well? I believe he's a Ram as well. I believe so, yeah. Homie the homie. Homie the homie. We got Pedro Park up. Let's see what's about to happen in here. Who dares to enter the mayhem? This is the loser semifinal. After this, I believe. I believe. It was Fresh, Fresh Phantom won last, so he went to Grand. Mm -hmm. Fresh new paper. Ramla Fresh For the winner of this match yeah. and loser finals. Mm hmm. And then I believe for that we play the finals. No. You yeah, know, newspapers lost. He's gonna win. He's gonna lose his final. Okay, okay. And then after yeah. the finals, grand final. All right. Ah. Yeah. I can read it. I don't go on this side a lot, so it's kind of hard to read. You know. <laughs> <laughs> just gotta, just gotta. Yeah. Case of what's happening. Yep. And there it is. And let's get right into this loser. I love Homie's smile. It's very genuine, very heartwarming. Yeah. I, I feel like that's that's the great thing uh, I like about like. At the uh, fighting games in general, even like especially with Strive, it's fun. The game is so fun. You can always get a genuine smile whenever you're losing, winning. It's mm -hmm. it's that type of game that Mankind. at the end of the day you're doing you yourself. Period. Mm -hmm. It's also a great learning. immediately. Chip You're the chip expert here, or 
are uh, it as uh, a chance against Ram? Make your opinion. Like, how do you think Chip is in this matchup? I feel like myself, because I play Chip, I suffer a lot against the Ram matchup. Until that, something like that happens. I find an opening, but I stay on the offensive. I never get off of her. I always take the opportunity to make sure that Alpha Blade hits. And Pedro takes that first match. So, first round. You're right. Expressing is showing exactly what you're saying. Fast. Chip is moving. Yeah. Like, you know what I think right now? I think yeah. Pedro is really going to chip on him and uh, making sure he's able to get in fast and hoping to react. But it seems like Hobie got that great hit. And a wake up throw from Chip. Pedro. Ooh. Wall Splash. Into the wall break. Still has no help. Again. Right. Huge overhead. Passing up a meter. Yes. This is the follow up. But into the burst instead. Nice trade. But it's hit. Oh, Sick it's burst from Pedro. Oh, the low is just done. Homie the homie. Taking round one. Round two, actually. This is anyone's game at this point. Oh, nice overhead. He bought it. Out of the way. Oh, immediately nice shutting down the air approach. Takes the pressure. Ooh, the sword version. Oh. Drops a combo. Ripple RT to stay on the offensive. Oh, almost wall breaking. Oh. Pedro fighting his way out. Gets that pressure back on. Jumping heavy after the after the after the after the really great. And if a man grabs the finish to close it out. Oh, the Wi-Fi Warrior Slayer. The Wi-Fi Warrior. Yo. <laughs> is it Alpha Blade? Is it Command Grab? Ah, it seems your rollback frames is on three. Time for Command Grab. <laughs> it's offline though, we can't be having that. You gotta have a good reaction. I think Toby just needs to get his bearings right now on this matchup. He looks he knows where to get those hits. Or he knows where to place a uh, small low to get a good conversion for big one. As you saw there, only preemptively jumping to avoid the possibility of a command grab. Oh, the beta blade. Oh, uh, uh, finish your food. The wall break. Positive for the tip. Home, little, almost uh, two bars of meter. He's trying to get it right there. Oh, great. But he'll number DP. Pedro really, really has to play through right now. That's the only reason for his art. Future set on open side. Pedro with the burst. No more meter. He's the load, taking out. And it looks like that round goes. Pedro really fought his way out, both of them at first. Ooh, it's nice. Hope he fight his way back out again. Ooh, the random 2H. The very tip of the blade catching Ramathal. Well, if, he, if he converted on that, I would have seen it. Because that would be cool. Ball. Ooh. Ooh. super. He baited this. Did you know Chip was a second type? He can see it to the future. He ran up FD. Saw it coming. Spending the damage. Getting the wall splat. The Ninja Spider-Man right now. <laughs> what side am I going to be? Where am I going? Oh! oh to finish it off. Pedro, moving on. <laughs> Homie, I, I like, I, I can definitely say Homie was trying his best to keep up with Pedro. Since Pedro's a really fast character, Pedro's using a really fast character like Chip, putting, applying that pressure and being able to get out immediately. And sometimes dealing with those cross-ups from Alpha Blade can be very hard to react to. It seems like Pedro really had a good footing in that match. Mm -hmm. One little thing, one little thing about Pedro's chip. More chip players need to use 6K. The little, the little you know, jump medium kick. Uh -huh. It's fast, and I'm pretty sure it's safe on block, so you can keep on the offensive. But I feel like, you know, for some reason, it's not being utilized enough. I don't know if it's lack of knowledge or just like he, he has his own game plan that I'm not aware of. But you know, as a chip player, 
you know, I'm going to sound entitled, but you need to abuse that 6K. That 6K is goaded. I could, I could definitely agree to that. I think maybe uh, the chip, some chip players may resort to the 6K when uh, when people start reacting to the Alpha Blade, being able to count it, being able to either react Ilya or even, Ray. better yet, uh, get a good 6P or count to them off it. Being able to chip react, react with a button and make them in a better sense of term if they were playing so explode mm -hmm. as most chips do but at that point it would if you did want to use the 6k it would be more for can opener into just to get that little bit of damage I yeah because you can't combo anything off of 6k it's more like it's most like like a, just like a damage check like a little bonk it means like hey sucker you know i'm up here mankind <laughs> yeah, it's like i know it hit you low but what you about your what? head right what about your beam you kind of need that <laughs> Right. Moving on a loser's one if we have fresh yeah, that, paper versus Central okay. Parker, fresh off his win and semi. Instant overhead, bad moon. In my opinion, these two characters are too fast to win. Both of them run around and cut Sick beta blade. There we go, the usage of the 6k. He might have gotten YRC, but at least he used it. Really makes Red Team hurt. Oh my god. It's paper mache versus paper. Yeah. Woo. Well, more like paper mache versus origami, you know? <laughs> <laughs> Both these characters, you breathe on them so much, it's too hard, they will die. So, that back from the frisbee was really smart. Honestly. Ooh, a nice yeah. First from the fresh boot paper. Both of them like it in that right now. The fresh boot paper is a little bit less health in the jazz. Slash. The jump key. Jumpy does it. Duel 2. Let's rock. Such a good air response. Yeah. Did you start off the round? What? The A chest? You know what I'm saying? The mad lad. With the grab. I don't know if you heard it through dust there. Also yeah. wicking the grab. They're doing the favor. Sushi. RC. Walking down a bit so he can get to the wall. He's not close enough to get the wall break. Using the gamma blade for the plus frames. That's good. The double grab. Do it again. Oh, no, oh, never so, mind. I think it was a DP. I think it was the DP. Three. No, I think he tried to grab out. I think it, we couldn't see it because the million was too high, but I'm pretty sure he tried to grab again. That's a counter measure. Good adaptation. Really, a really good change. A huge 2D counter. <laughs> Out of my brain. It's the command grab. Five feet as a response. Oof. Almost getting the wall break. Amazing and there it is. Into the wall break. And as I say it, so it shall happen. Oh, yes, me, yes, me. Man. Please. Duel one. One on fresh paper side. <laughs> Trying to go for a nice low. Get the hard knockdown. Six feet to get him off the air. <laughs> Oof. Immediately with the grab for this. Conversion. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Into the first. It's a nice first move because it puts her back, puts her in the corner. This is the gamma blade. Bad move. Fresh is doubling up the corner, not the table. Air and the wall break is dead. She let it. She let it rip. She let it rip into the wall break. Paper, meat cutter. <laughs> With Pedro saying, I see what you did there last time. Huge but six feet. How would you like it in the corner? Oh, the first. The first, the first but the show. This is the opportunity to capitalize on it. Still gets a big hit. With the grab. Yeah, this is the big help that the fresh new papers right now. Pedro is capitalizing on the mistake. Getting a command grab, I think he's dead. Yes, it is. Ooh. Responding Duel back. Three. Well, to the assault from last time. Fresh Moon Kick is going back to the assault, taking their man. Getting an early wall break. Woo! Less than 10 seconds. Pedro, over to the 39th. Where did Parker's health bar go? I'm telling you, 
these characters, bro, they don't they scar up. It's it's really tragic how hard like blocks the first but fails the follow up. Honestly, and there it is. Two oh Ooh. fresh new two oh oh. One more, one more. Duo right now for fresh new paper. I think Pedro really needs to Duel work one. on that salt he is Let's doing. Rock. Taking, taking better opportunities. <laughs> taking the few less risks. It seems like fresh new paper is really capitalizing on those. Utilizing far heavy slash. Hits but does, but doesn't charge it. Look at all the pressure that oh, overhead. Tsukiyashi, oh, he says, I'm not into Asian food. I'm good. I'm allergic. <laughs> I don't want to be here. Pedro still with that burst. First two paper, 50%, no burst. He's trying to see if he can get a hit right now. Pedro gets that low and he has to lose. Oh my god, the Bankai! Bankai! Huh. I said Bankai. I'm wrong. <laughs> no more anime for you. Oh, uh, dang. <laughs> I gotta go. Ooh, command that forward draft. It seems like instant overhead bad mood is kind of like a it's a curse on these players because they just can't seem to respond accordingly. Walk the super. Hey, Pedro, still with that burst. He's just trying to hold on to it. He might be holding on to it next round. Whoa, the huge DP from Pedro. Why are she get off me? Trying to walk him down into the corner. Make sure he has no escape. Finally using that burst. Getting the counter, and now Fresh New Paper is in the first I feel like he's gonna try and use it the moment Pedro gets a, a good hit. Nice disc, gets the mix, one more disc. Trying to size him up right, both of them trying to get a nice size of hit. Just some hit, some hit that makes it to the next round, or just kill for the win in the round. I think we need to push in or else he loses his meter. Ooh, Newspaper try to go for the read with the air throw. Pedro making him sure to know not to test me in the air. Nah. The question is... Okay, is there, will there be a... You know what? Let's not say that yet. Well, let's not, let's not curse the players. Pedro back at an offense, good command grab. Back on the offense, not the alpha blade, but still having that pressure, not caring about the burst, keeping the jump. Looks like jump out of our ooh. Red Team is just under assault right now. Really trying to run away from that red team that they just showing, and then putting it back on him. Fresh, fresh new paper. Block oh, beta blade. That's already a 30% chunk of his health. With more to come from this next mix-up. Bad RG. mood. Bad Pedro's mood. Pedro's living though. He has a bit of life. He can take up two bad. And he's top. The bird. Wall break. They're slow for so low health. It's anyone's game right now. Next hit wins, basically. Oh, using that RC. See if you can get something off it. Both of them are positive. Punishes oh. the 6P with R. What a play! What an answer! Let's rock. Both really trying to... Yeah, it seems like both of them really want that hit. While also at the same time, trying to go away from getting that big hit that would make their health. All these small folks, Pedro will get the hit again. Will Fresh New Paper be able to grab back some damage to Pedro? Which, like, I'm not even good conversion. Won't be able to do wall to wall, but he can get mid screen. <laughs> Yellow RC, get off to it. And here we play trying to hit each other with their big buttons. Pedro, still with the burst though. Yellow RC, get off Please! I want to play the game. We are using the superior air mobility. Oh, Dancing circles around Gold mid. Oh. 6k confirmed into the wall combo. Let's go. Good gold burst. That was, a, that was a really nice play. Nice conversion to the route. Caught the jumping frames with 2D. Lily a hippity hopping. Both of them really trying to use their multiple. Both of them jump as a way to capitalize on random throwing out moves. Not, I'm not going to say random, but throwing out moves. Or you can try to whip them. Throwing out that super. Building up that wrist gauge. 
Yellow RC, get off me. First, you get off me. But that 5k is a killer right now. Either converting it to a small combo or getting those quick pokes in. Oh, man grab. What's it next? The low. It's a 2 speed. 2 2 right now. Oh, Pedro's it. farting for his life, bro. Yo, you can see, you can see through the mask. Pedro is smiling. He is. Woo! He is Sweating profusely, right fresh new papers, using e nasty plot, increasing that special special attack, right? Ooh. I'm a bit rusty on my Pokemon, but I'm getting there. Really just that once more like the But it's really that that Yeah. Use the BRC to make himself safe there. Yup. The command grab. Both have burst. What's gonna happen? Seems like Fresh is gonna save that burst. Pedro with the perfect. What is Fresh Blue response? But he's taking the lead now. Trying to get a little bit, trying to get hit in, get that risk game. Yeah. Which is every one. Just a ring around the rosy in the corner. You can get locked in. Fresh blue paper in jail. Ooh, finding his way out. With the man down. With the low, with the setup. Ooh. Oh, he's with the grab. Huge no. burst, though. Unrelenting offense, building up that risk gauge. Just Pedro, getting out with Alpha Blade. Pedro close to getting 50%. Close an overhead Pedro. bad move. Yellow RC immediately after. Get off of me. Oh, using that dash to back, that air dash to get out. That 60 command dash into the 2D. Oh mix. my god. Mix. This is the last. This is Whoa. game point. This is for the marbles. Both of them fighting so hard to keep Big Why counter hit. Uh, Putting him in the corner, setting up Beyblade, going for the low. Blocks the bad moon. Suki like Suki out the corner. Ooh, yellow RC, get off me. Bars. Oh. J2K, I haven't seen being used enough, or I should I say abused enough. Oh, oh a overhead. big overhead. Cross is up, though. Seems like he probably. I think he wanted to try and dash under, but he took what he can. Burst style. The burst. Command grab. The net code nemesis command grab. Lord. The low. 50 RC. He tried to go for the command grab. Why RC? Yellow RC. Okay. Oh Into the God. alpha blade. The reverse. Pedro with the reverse. Reverse three. Oh ninja. my goodness. Go be a ninja. Go be a ninja. Go watch, the, go watch Naruto. <laughs> That's my president right there. <laughs> <laughs> Honest. Bro, I can't even lie. Both players playing exceptionally well. Yeah. Not giving up. I think every single match was like down to the wire. Wasn't yeah. It? Last match situation. Neither one of them giving up at any cost. Yeah. There was no like, there was no there was no one one way beating. It was both of them constantly on top of each other, constantly you know improvising, downloading off of each other, and playing and improvising accordingly. <sighs> download, not download, improve, adapt. <laughs> Improvise, adapt, <laughs> overcome. <laughs> That's what you love to see, though. Those those mental changes in game plans mm -hmm. and how you respond to certain actions and moves. That's what you love to see in yeah, matches. Yeah, the adjustments, you know, like Pedro blocking the bad moon overhead. That's been giving a lot of play players trouble. That immediately set up to me. It's like, you know, this guy's had enough. This guy's like, I know what you're going to do. It's not going to work on me anymore. It's my turn to pull off some nonsense. And even f fresh newspapers adapting to seeing those command grabs from Chip and even being able to start blocking those Alpha Blade cross-ups, not letting him get that little bit of damage and that... You know, and the setup. Yeah. What's, what's even... What's, I definitely like seeing, like, from the million players that's been playing today, well, from newspaper especially, seeing how he can change just even the slightest hit. Immediately in his mind, RC, conversion, I mm -hmm. need this meter. I'm, I may not get as much damage as I want, but I want the advantage. Some damage is better than no damage. Honestly. Even better, it results in a knockdown, letting him set up you know, Frisbee or whatever other shenanigans that they're going to pull off. And even the bursts were well placed as well. Just yeah. being able to get some of the gold bursts or even just, please get off me. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to get regain control of the match. Personal space. <laughs> 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 this is my square. Right. I will strive for you to stay out of yeah. it. <laughs>
know, burst is just the social distance button. <laughs> I, I, I want you away from me. Six you, feet. you don't have a mask on. You're not respecting my privacy, my space, my well-being. I want you away from me. <laughs> I, I don't yeah. want you in. Well, that was actually a really great losers finals. We're now going on to the grand finals, I believe. Pedro coming from making did he make his way? Oh, well, came in at quarterfinal, making his way through the losers up to up to grand finals. And here we have Phantom, really prominent, staying strong throughout the entire tournament. His rhythm has actually been pretty pretty spot on. Yeah. Either dominating or if he does start to get a decline, immediately adapting to what's happening. Right. It, it seems like, honestly, if I had to throw my money, I say, I say, Pedro might have this. Pedro might have this. You think so? Yes. For the for the fact is, he's shown that he's able he's he's able to use chip speed mm -hmm. and a lot of his good cross ups to his advantage to mix up the opponent and make them kind of worry what's going to happen next. Yeah, that's why I dub chip the netcode nemesis, man. <laughs> yeah. He takes full advantage of it. Guilty and then while you have Phantom, who's really good at adapting and capitalizing off even the slightest counter hit, immediately getting big damage, and which is going to be a real big problem for Pedro. Getting hit once can really mm -hmm. explode his health and the match and the tournament. Mm -hmm. It's just as soon as they see that they have a hit, even if it's blocked, mm -hmm. they're already thinking, what can I get off this? How can I make you block more? Or how can I possibly open you up? Do I go for a throw? Do I go for a 2D? Do I go for the big old Kokoda, you know? <laughs> yeah. I think uh, one really, really big problem between this matchup uh, is where since the chip has to worry about getting hit, period, he really has to play careful way he bursts. Because he doesn't burst at the right time, burst at the right time. He can then just immediately get punished. And now, instead of 50%, maybe 60%, the yeah, this grand finals. Uh, even if he bursts, it's like he messes up that burst. Now, from 60%, his entire life force is gone. And he's now back into the next round. Mm. On the other hand, Phantom can actually just make a few mistakes. He doesn't want to make those mistakes, but he has a leeway to how many mistakes he can make in this mm -hmm. matchup. It's a very forgiving matchup, honestly. It seems like taking a little bit of time. I, I can I ask you, how have you, what's your opinion on these past matches? What do you, what do you think? It's been particular? nothing but, you know, entertaining this entire time. Even so, even though some of the matchups that people call sleeper matches, you know, Axel versus, you know, Leo or people, a lot of those matchups have been really fun to watch. I got to learn a lot. I got to see, like, the mindset of an Axel player in person. Because online is a different landscape, obviously, but even with World Band Neko, but watching it in person, watching them, you know, do their thing, have their game plan, executing that game plan, and just adapting overall, it's mm -hmm. been, like, it's been eye-opening. I might try out Axel. Who knows? I might be, um, this might be my, my villain arc. Who knows? All right, hold on. <laughs> Sir, <laughs> stop. <laughs> what, I'm not villainous enough for Potemkin, bro? Yo, see, Potemkin's you can't, the hero of the story. What you you mean? can't <laughs> trust Potemkin players because they go into Axu. <laughs> this is, they go from grabbing you to spacing you out. You can't, there's just no way. I mean, slide head. True. Slide <laughs> Unless they're jumping, slide head, like even the first hit of their, like, chain thing. Yeah. Slide head is armored. Why? It, he needs it. No. He needs it. <laughs> he needs it. It does no damage. The trade-off is it's armored, yes, but it does no damage. It just knocks you down. Okay. And then I put on my Heelys and then, uh, uh, you know? Understandable. But uh, for me, I definitely I could def I definitely liked uh, how the matches went, being able to see the adaptations and see how people played around certain matchups, even if it weren't in their favor. Mm -hmm. The adaptation that happened, the the changes, that, the little changes that were made in people's minds and gameplays and how they responded was just so beautiful to watch. Mm -hmm. Definitely, it definitely shows how the change from off online. Off. It definitely shows how the change from all online or offline has affected people and people just getting right back in the field of things, making sure they know what's happening. Making sure they aren't affected by, oh no, this little lag spike, and now your character is uh, slightly better than mine. Yeah. Versus. So, let's see what happens here. Adrian you Parker on the left. The right? No, Phantom's on the left. He's player one. Pedro's player two right now. 
no switch. Pedro coming from Luzon. Oh, that's Pedro. Yep. Pe and Phantom. Yep. Phantom has the nice long. He has the cool Star Wars shirt. Mm hmm. Pe Pedro definitely. Wait, no. Phantom's the one with the cool Star Wars shirt. Pedro's the one with the mask. I messed up. But Pedro's <laughs> coming from losers, so if he actually wins it, this. He clawed his way out of hell. True. He clawed his way out. But then they got a, it's a reset. Hmm. So that's another that's another three matches you gotta do there. We've got a couple more towers to climb, bro. Come on, man. It's tower. You at floor ten right now. This is Gurandu of Finals. Phantom is in the celestial area, but he has come down to floor ten to great to try and take you down. Send him back down to the mortal realm. <laughs> Duel one. Here we go. Let's rock. Already starting out with a six P. Ooh, uh, the 5k, 6k. Really just hitting that hard advantage. Vince jumping out of the corner. He's not scary. But the pressure. Going out of sword. The jab. The jab. Oh my the jab. God. <laughs> How many jabs? How much help did that take? Wait. How much help did that take? Bro, so there's about seven jabs with seven JPs. What? Nani? Yo. Big boy in the media bursting. Said, I may have scissors on my back, but I can rip up paper too. The grab. Throwing out the sword for the pressure. With the grab. Oh my gosh. The grab immediately the first. The DP. Did you know it's buy one, get one free for the grabs? There we Kill. go. Oh, uh, Pedro closing his mouth. Pedro was not having it. He said, yeah, I may be paper, but I can beat up scissors still. I can still give you a paper cut. That's for damage. <laughs> Alpha Blade, Alpha Blade back on the other side to keep the corner. I like that safety right there. Honestly, if I ever get jumped in real life, I want to see counter. I want to see counter the first hit I get. Oh, oh, oh two, three, four, four five. five. Break the wall. Oh, let's go. Pedro still with all that health. Low kick and then a low. Sweet. Looking like it might Huge 2D. Nice first round going to Pedro. <laughs> First game. First game. Uh, let's see. We are back up. A little lower. Wait, talk. Only. Yeah. Okay, that's, that's much better. Ah, uh, let's go. It's like in the heat of the battle, I can barely hear my own thoughts. That's how loud it gets. Uh, uh, well. <laughs> About to get back into the to grand final. I'm really, I'm, I'm hyped to see what happens next. I feel like. Chip is on it. Honestly, I don't want to pray on Phantom's downfall. I want to see a reset. I want to see mm -hmm. how he changes his entire game plan. Because it seems like Pedro immediately, after that first scrap, at the beginning, losing all that help, he immediately changed how he played and started training the tight off rip, getting the good damage, finding that great pressure, making sure he doesn't get hit, get any like straight counter hits on him. Mm -hmm. I think Phantom really needs no with it interrupt. That's that's the biggest thing. Not interrupting Chip, especially in the air. It may be a bit hard since Chip does have three jumps, but we can't see anything. Dual one. Let's rock. <laughs> Ah, here, we go. here we go. Here we go. We are back. Pedro takes it back up to the direction. Okay. Doing the rest of stopping at the low. Big counter. Oh, I'm in it. Oh, he's already spending his first. Remeth already backing up, creating space. Oh, using that. YRC to the red RC. Both already wasted. 
using their percent. We just need a three moment cancel. Literally red light, green light. All the jabs. The jabs. Yo, How many jabs is that? He said, you remember earlier last match? Yo, what a situation. How does it feel? Run up beta plate? Oh. Dad, this is not getting it. Overhead. Double overhead, gamma blade for the plus frame. Oh my god. Senju chipping him out. Look at that wrist gauge. That wrist gauge was looking spicy. Full on offense. You will not breathe today. Up 6p, knocks him down. Phantom. How can you get a nice hit on chip? Oh, nice big counter. Hit. No burst. Oh my god. What a conversion. Oh, no. The health. Kill him. The health. Kill him. Oh my god. 90% off of a stray hit! Somebody clip that! Yo. Good lord, man! That ain't so damage. That ain't it. so damage because it would've killed us! Oh my god! Look at this! And look at Aegon really just going Persistent balls to the wall. Persistent blade. Really trying to get back a lead. Did it! Looks like he didn't want to get hit by that stray hit. But take you back in control. Counter. Oh, burst what an in. answer. Oh, he's missing the two S because of the burst. Oh, both he's still gone. fighting. He's still out here. He's trying Trump to get the, the command, command grab. grab. Throwing up the sword. Barely any tension to FD. Oh, what? I think he grabbed. What happened? I, I, he did the... Uh, he ran up, probably did 6 hit. She grabbed. So it was a trade. Oh. Blocks the Alpha Blade. Oh, the Big oh, damage. Right Big damage, my word. Ooh, nice answer from Parker. 6 8 Oh, back to the Alpha Blade. Alpha blade. Getting back to the corner. The big counter. Uh, uh, uh. Whoa. Uh. It's a positive for Pedro. But Phantom does have that 50 percent. Has to be careful. He can just roll super and wake up. He can definitely try to whip from the ramp. Oh. Bigger buttons. Grandma taking kindly to that wall break, returning the favor or oh. not. Grab. Oh, she had a drop on her mind. She had a drop on her mind. Whoa! Super. Where did he go? The momentum from the super kept him going to the corner. Both of them low Kick health. Him. Kick him. Oh, overhead six k. Both of them low. FD Utilizing that far slash with Has greatest burst use. right now. Burst out. Great burst from Ram. Barely any oh. meter to FD from Ram. Going up. Jab, 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 jab. Ooh, with the slash. close slash. What an answer. Boat, bro. Pedro was on low health. This is the power of the ninja. He's on the prowl. He's out here. <laughs> he is fighting back. He does not care how low health he is. He will fight you no matter what. Fight like a tiger. Sword through the sky, man. His theme is good for something. That. If anything, Phantom, I think he he needs to do it one. not Let's letting run. up on that pressure. Yeah. Because he's he, he, he taking, he's getting, he's getting away. He's being able to escape every single time. Oh! Got it, Burst. Oh, his health was already gone. But again, Pedro. His smile is optimism gone. His health, nowhere to be found. But Pedro still fighting strong. Why are off these? Let's get Ace into the grab. Immediate run up. I think. Oh. Who came to the grab whiffing it? Wow. Far slash beat Chip's best button right now. Into the massive overhead. Great toss. Phantom almost. Up. One, two, three, four, five. Oh! Oh my. It, it's so great to see that. So great. Wow. Dual two. With great Let's neutral roll. comes big damage. <laughs> I think that's a cult. That's definitely how the cult goes. I believe it. Oh, what? The clash, yeah. That 6P is all hitbox, no hurtbox. Uh, oh, yeah. Don't look away. Double grab. Setting up the sword. Double grab. Cancel. Going out another sword. RT. Trying to Locked down, get the sword again, going out the another sword. Oh my god, the wrist gauge. Oh, counter hit. I think he's dead. Can he pull the ground? Yes, he can. Slash. Nice job, Phantom. Duel three. Let's rock. What's the first option? Medium 5k. Big counter. 
and like he really hopes with the attack like, that bird for getting hit that counter. Ooh, the trade, interesting. Ooh. Nice jump back into S. After goes to the low. Completing it. Guard break. Page getting out. See if he can get something started. Nice dust guard. Both of them doing success. Why are you? Into the grass. Oh, it's now one. Phantom taking another. Well, taking a game, I should say. Seems like he's really, really adapting well to what's happening right now. Making sure he locks down better. Let's rock. Not letting, not letting the entire game get ran away. Cause honestly, Sinek is just one of those characters that's really good at taking, even when he's at the lowest health, being able to take the game and just run with it the entire time. Jesus, man, grab, shit, out the way up. Overhead, watch the overhead. Game of Blade for the plus frame. Uh, 6 H is really good at keeping people down. With that grit. Bringing you back down to Earth. Nice. The two hit Beta Blade. Oh, Mortal yeah. Model taking a third of his health! So, this game was the game. Where does he have to throw and Parker takes the round? That game, that game was looking at was looking at you, Xavier. Then it got even again. Yeah. <laughs> Big counter up to the This is the Senju. Wish the air grab. I think you expect uh, Ram to go. Ram yeah, so just because you're in the air don't mean I gotta respect you. Honestly. Big counter. RC misses the opportunity to get a confirm bomb. Jumps out of the short explosion. Oh, Wish the confirm. Oh, sick over from Parker. Santa not having it, get off me. Double jumping. to get out a good counter. Jumping at Oh, nice up. alpha play. Ooh, big play. Whoa. Nice. Dual three. That bar at big insurance. Take the back up for the eye frame. Oh, I, lo I love seeing that set up. Big, big overhead. Every time he gets hit, it's just, oh my god. Oh my, no, please, the health. My, my, oh lord, the game have is over. mercy, oh, no. mercy, half it, of his health evaporated in a single combo. I would like to call that the chip speed run. Oh, any percent? Any percent? Glitchless? <laughs> Yo, so keep going. this is a sick category for speed running. Yo, someone put that on Twitter, no soul speed run chip damage. Because that, woo. Every time that I see that man gets hit, it's either he lives, maybe he'll run away with the game, or let let go, GG go next. GG go next. One. Let's rock. All right. Uh, both with the five k start. One game away from resetting. Phantom just needs to close it out to secure himself. Spot of champion. Parker already bursting. I'm just keeping him away. Making those big buttons work for her. Facing him out. Ajo Parker getting down. his station. Duel two. Let's run. One game. One game away. Nice. Nice job with the S. Jumping on the corner. Through the bird. Looks like Pedro is really trying to find a way to fight his way out. Ooh, in the corner. But Phantom is not having to keep him there with the counter hit. Almost being able to get the wall break, but not quite. Jay, Oh, the grab after the kick. Ooh, one more grab. Nope, he's able to cover his cage. Parker with a side switch. Big oh. grab. Netcode Nemesis. Oh, 6K. Blocks it. Why is he get off? He puts him in the corner. He does not do anything, though. Back down. Really trying to face out. He has the burst. On. What is the option? Big the counter overhead sends you. And he closes out the round. Nice. Parker is not letting up right now. 5K, 5K. Big counter hit 6H. Trying to make it. 
all these giant buttons that she got. Great revenge. Though so he is, one toy down, got the other toy. Pushing him to the corner. The pressure is really getting on him right now. Risking coming down a bit, but it was just at the same time. A steady mind. Ooh, the double purple RC. And the first. first. Didn't go for the five jabs this time out of respect. Respectfully keeping Axel in this corner. Ooh, with a giant DP. That risk a lowering. The central overhead. Running away. Trying to take the game. Will Pedro reset the, bra the bracket? Come on. Give us a show, gentlemen. Oh, big man. counter hit. Oh, it's a no. big damage. What? Is he going to shoot her? Nah, he's not dead. He's not dead. He's not dead. He's not dead yet. He's not dead yet. It's anyone's game still. Next hit wins. He has Peter. Now he's going to counter the sword throw. Oh, in the alpha blade. And the reset. Yo, the reset. Yo, the reset. Yo, the reset. Both well played harder. Not time. giving up for the reset right now. Oh, oh my god. Chips and of Chips and of does whatever a chip does. <laughs> Reset the bracket, makes you up. First from Edro. Big buttons. Nice Big damage. Two H to the sword throw. Might be able to get that ball break. Oh my goodness. Into the throw. What an answer. Would you believe if I told you the had a 100% health at one point? Yeah, it was. Think about that, huh? <laughs> Two, three, four, five! Break the wall! Oh my god. And she's out of here! Not yet. Let's begin. Oh, Ooh. This does not matter. Did you think it's swept down. in slow motion? Let's <laughs> rock. Yeah. Sushi, 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 come on. Low. Only spacing out the wreck Trying to well place their buttons, making sure they don't get hit this time. But that wrist game on the oh my god. Not like hit now. Again, 50% now. Getting back up there, almost 100% wrist game. And the dust. Oh, the dust oh. connecting to the sword explosion. He, he got hit three times. His health. He got hit three times. The health. Counter. Oh, oh, the trade counter hit into the kill. Duel three. Let's rock. Last round, this one. Oh, nice with the lady to wait for the other guy. Six days. Wall almost breaking. Oh, Last with six feet. Phantom bursting out. Pedro parking out. Run, having nothing, nothing to do with the one, two, three, four, five. That's oh. all she wrote. Ooh, the wall break. Oh, uh, Alpha Blade. Oh, really trying to call it ground. not Why are Pedro Oh, the bird does not want to lose this right now. But it seems like he's trying to run away with the nest. Why are we again? And Ajo pulls it out. It's not letting him, though. Really have a really good defense up. And a bird. Go bird. Look at this out. Using far slash to close out the round. This better help with nothing in this school. Go be a ninja. I agree. Go be a ninja. <laughs> I heard they pay really well. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, fun fact. Anji and Chip are good friends. And they work in, and Anji works on your chip. Really? I know. Best part about it, the secret Duel character. One. They share one brain. <laughs> Let's <laughs> rock. Yeah. <laughs> I believe it. <laughs> Just hearing the quotes, especially like when they do the arcade to go to Chicago, they get so excited for no reason. Oh, oh, oh. Nah, I think oh, it's oh, no burst. Breaking the wall instead earlier. Okay, good amount of damage though. About fifty yeah. percent. Pedro, honestly, this is so easy. <laughs> There's still, honestly, this is so easy. Help. One good count hit for Pedro. Pedro is bleeding. Burst. Oh. And capitalize off that fifth place burst. Oh my and, word. Like I said. My word. As I said, that is easy no matter what. Super, heart season 
I think Parker got a little bit too anxious trying to run out for a button. I think that's what they call footsies. Literally. It seems like no one here is afraid to jump out the corner. Because they know at one point the person's gotta stop. You gotta you gotta be expecting a ZP. Uh, seems like Mortal Finn. Bottle into 2k to close out the game. 1-1 one, one right now. Both of them are not letting up. Really buying that pressure. I didn't win anything. I'm just strong. Yeah, a strong duel. Duel one. <laughs> Let's rock. Not to worry. I'm, I'm just a high tier. Oh, oh, the burst really burst oh, from Finn. Oh, already Finn's a burst from And a burst from Parker. Oh, 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 jumps over Mortal Bottom. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, it's the red RC yeah. to burn. Mm. And wall breaks for positive. Pedro oh, always is just with those wall breaks and converts. Always able to get that BVP. So he's quite back against Ramathal. Oh, oh, it's the side switch. Switch the Raffle Blade. Oh, yeah, Gets the command grab to yeah, close out the round. Honestly, you don't think it's going to do a lot of damage, but then it kills and you're just like, yeah. Huh. Maybe I should have jumped. Or just, just don't get grabbed. <laughs> I hear people ask me all the time, how do you beat such and such? How do you beat Pod Buster? How do you beat Trips Command Grab? Just don't get grabbed. I'm so Everybody's coming. It, it, it's, it's just clockwork, bro. It's just clockwork. It's clockwork. Yes, perfect. Perfect duel. Mid conversation. Let's already killing. I, I, I thought that in my mind. So straight hits. Really Change the pace of the match. Like I said earlier, Pedro really doesn't have a big leeway on it, it's Go be a from ninja. Long struggle fights to Duel just one. back and forth. Yeah. One Let's person rock. strong in one one round. There's a lot of round. push and pull going on. on it, honestly, yeah. anything can happen. I think. Yeah. Not sure I agree with the first there from Parker. I would have taken it for a big counter hit as a defense. Yeah. That's a punish on Rem's foot. Getting the pressure down. Pushing her to the cover. Oh, he's getting a nice conversion. Oh, tried to make the jury. I see what he's trying to do there, but Grant's like, no, I'm going to hold on to this. Pressure, command grab. He's moving, though. Oh, oh Nemesis. Saving the first for the next one. I feel like that was a good switch for Phantom. Not using that burst early on. Raw oh, beta blade, look at punish. 5k for the shadow clone. For the plus man, 6d. Vance is seeing like he can only get these small pokes right now. Well, Pedro is able to just get big conversions off the combos. Being able to. Being able to. And there goes the chip out. Pedro Parker winning 3 1. Such an amazing match from the grand finals to the reset. Oh my god. This has been really fun to watch, really fun to commentate. Honestly. Let's let's see, hold up, let's see if we can get uh one of them on. Uh you wanna talk to him or talk to him. Chip play it, chip play it. Nah, nah, nah. This, this is gonna be 